Finally, we have some big news for an app where we relive our most precious memories and adventures, photos. Our photo libraries contain all of the big and small moments in our lives. But as we capture so much and our libraries grow bigger by the day, how can we keep it all organized so we can appreciate all those moments and easily get to the good stuff? iOS 18 brings the biggest redesign ever to the Photos app. To tell us more about the all-new design, here's Chelsea. The new Photos app keeps your library organized and makes it super easy to find photos fast. So you can spend less time searching and more time enjoying your memories. Let me show you. This new design is gorgeous, feels familiar, and it puts everything you want right at your fingertips. The app has been unified into a single view with the photo grid at the top and your library organized by theme below. The photo grid is a great place to view your entire library. When you want to quickly jump back to specific dates, you can use months and years views at the bottom. I have a lot in my library, so it's great that this filter button lets me quickly narrow it down to specific types of content. And now, I can even filter out screenshots to enjoy my photos clutter-free. We know that it can be tough to keep our ever-growing libraries organized, so we've built on the amazing intelligence in the Photos app and created a space below the grid that makes it easy to access the photos you care about most. We call these collections. With collections, you can browse by topics like time, people, my favorite memories, new ones like trips, and more. Let's go back and check out recent days. Recent days organizes photos by each day with clutter like receipts filtered out. Here are my photos from earlier today. You'll see an auto-playing view of all the photos at the top. I can swipe between days like this to see my hike yesterday. I can view the photos as a beautiful collage and I can share the whole collection with just a tap right here. When I wanna find a specific person in my library, I head to People and Pets, and it now includes my favorite groups of people for the first time. Here's me with my husband, Don, and with my best friends. The new trip section gathers all your memorable adventures in one place. I love that they autoplay so I can remember my trips while I browse. I can quickly jump back in time and revisit a trip, like this one to Patagonia in 2021. Since everyone's photo library is unique, Photos is now customizable, so you can elevate the topics that are most important to you. You can reorder collections to put them in the order you like. I've put pinned collections right here. It's where I can keep things I access frequently, like favorites, photos I've recently saved, the places I've been, and even an album of my favorite climbs. And we have one more new space to make the Photos app your very own and enjoy your best moments. If you swipe right from the grid, you'll find the new carousel, which highlights your best content in a beautiful poster-like view. Photos you've marked as favorites are here, and so are featured photos, surfaced by the app. And you can customize this too. Here, I've added a favorite trip to Crater Lake. Each day, the carousel surprises you with a new set of photos to enjoy for each of these. And that's a quick peek at the new Photos app.